Hey gorgeous! Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm here to solve a common problem that we face with hair toppers. We all know how frustrating it is when our topper looks flat and unnatural straight out of the box or after you wore it for some time. Especially this is typical with long uh, toppers. But don't worry, I have an amazing hub that will help you add volume to your topper roots in no time. Before we begin, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel so you never miss another video like this one. Plus, by subscribing you will be able to keep up with all my latest tips and tricks for wigs and toppers. Now, let's get started! The technique I'm about to show you is super simple yet incredibly effective. First of all, you don't need any fancy equipment, just something you already have laying around in your house. I've done it a million times, ok, maybe not a million times, but a lot, and I want to show you this method which works. So watch through the end and skip all the mistakes I've done along the way. First things first, wash your topper as usual. If you don't know how to do it or not sure about it, don't worry, I have a video that explains everything step by step. Once your topper is washed and rinsed, instead of drying it on a headstand, Take any ribbon and create a loop by threading it through each clip. This will allow you to easily hang the topper up to dry. You can use a usual laundry dryer like I do. The key here is to make sure that the topper hangs smoothly and evenly without stretching or creating folds in the cup of the topper. Hang it up and let it air dry overnight. Make it sure to avoid direct sunlight that can damage the hair. When your topper is fully dry, it will look similar to this. And right now I will wear it, so you will see how it looks before uh, any styling or blowout. Okay, so this is how it looks right after the drying. I didn't do any styling or blowout. I just wanted to show you how it looks right after uh, it just dried. And as you can see, now it has this natural looking volume in the roots. From here, now you just need to simply style it as you would normally do, uh, whether that's blow drying or heat styling. And if you need some tips on how to style your topper after washing, I have a great video about that for you here. Okay, so this is the final uh, step. I uh, styled my topper, I straightened it, and uh, now you can see that the topper still has this amazing volume on the, at the top, and uh, this is how you achieve it. Uh, thanks for watching and I hope this hack will be useful to you and don't forget to subscribe and to like this video. See you in the next one. Bye!